Hey guys, welcome back to Life is Strange. In the last part, Kate killed herself and apparently we were able to save her, but I couldn't rewind and I picked the wrong options and I'm still mad about it. Um, <laughs> we also finished episode two and now we're gonna get into episode three, so let's get into it. Okay, continue. Maybe there's a... I don't know. I'm... I'm triggered. <laughs> I don't like that I... That... Mm, I don't like that now that I know that I could have saved her and that I chose the wrong things to say. Oh, oh my gosh. In the previous episodes of Life is Strange... Okay, here's a little preview. ...film little pieces of time. Because Max wants everybody to see I'm so sick of people trying to control me! Don't ever touch me again, freak! It totally makes sense. You hell saved my life. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> We're going to be sorry someday. And there she is. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Let's talk about your superpower. Hey, Stelma and Louise, you're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? You want me to cut you, bitch? Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Please, get me out of here! Maybe I was supposed to shoot him. Most people Nobody chose cares that. Nobody about me. Nobody. So mad that I could have prevented that, and I didn't. What are you doing here, Max? Now, I know today was difficult for everybody. Miss Coffee, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Please, tell us everything. What the hell is this? Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I believe you, Warren. I'll believe anything this week. see what episode 3 has in store for us. Life is Strange is a story-based game that features player choice. The consequences of all your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. If our decisions can affect the past, hopefully we can save Kate in the future. As nonsensical as that is, so is this game. So, oh, I'm so mad I couldn't save her. I tried to be friendly every option and every time that I could be. Okay, it's night time. Butterflies. Why do these butterflies look like cardboard to me? Oh, these are moss? That would make more sense. Oh, little lightning bugs. I just saw lightning bugs like I think a month ago and I don't think I'd ever seen them before. They're so magical. Life is Strange, Episode 3, Chaos Theory. If I look at the camera a lot, it's not because I'm full of myself, it's because I'm always checking to make sure it isn't absolutely dead. Ooh, we had a nightmare about Kate. Sometimes things just stop recording for no reason. I have something to show you. Meet me in front of campus. Get that ass in gear now. I knew Chloe would be all over this. So I better get moving. Oh, we're taking care of her bunny now. I still can't stop thinking about Kate. See, Lisa? At least I kept you alive. I guess I'm oh. better with plants than people. Let's feed the rabbit before we leave. Bunny? Here, not on this. Hey, Bunny. Don't be too bummed, but from now on, I'm your new mommy. Why did 
do I always have to sneeze every other part? Come on, Max. No more tears. <sighs> I think I have you that, have to act, uh... not react. That thing where when there's a bright light in your face, you sneeze? Jeez, um, I have a ring so light, so... I'm fucking tired. It's not the best <laughs> ring light. I don't, uh... I don't know. Glad the media doesn't... Hmm. Besides Rachel, it's been a while since anybody vanished from our... Uh, this is such a moving piece of cut-and-paste black robe bullshit. Nobody here had Kate's back. <coughs> too little, too late. Dear Max Caulfield, as you're no doubt aware, Blackwell Academy lost a valued and beloved student this week with the ta tragic death of Kate Marsh. Everyone who encountered Kate, from faculty to student body, remember her as... A kind, intelligent, and talented person with a bright future. The staff of Blackwell Academy understands the social and academic trauma that comes with a public incident such as this, and we believe it's vital that we hear directly from the students about their thoughts and concerns. We encourage you to call our 24 hour hotline, 1 800 Blackwell, 1 800 Blawwell, to speak with a professional counselor no matter what your question or situation might be. In other words, Blackwell Academy has your back, Principal Wells. Yes, now everybody mm. loves Kate Marsh. They bullied her and now post their feels? Hypocrites. Victoria m said, requiscat in pace? Taylor, in our heart forever. Eva will never forget you and never forgive them. Alyssa, I'll remember your smile. Father Lamont, blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. Black Phil, Blackwell Bigfoot's promise to win the next game in your memory. Courtney, I wish we had hung out more. Mark, we love you, Katie. The church cries. Either I delete my That's page bullshit. or I block everybody. Nowhere to hide these days. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Everybody will be talking about Kate now. Blackwell might as well shut down for the next month. Come on, Max. No more tears. Or I already did that, okay. You have to act, not react. Oh my god, it's so dark. Okay, this I forgot is it was very night. dark. Let there be. Oh, there was a scene where me and Chloe were running through the hallways with a, a flashlight. Oh no. That means this episode is... that's gonna happen. So much hypocrite. Honestly, though, that's fucked up. Wait, could I do something? Oh. God. That's like some awful TV crime scene in our dorm. Oh, wait a second. I didn't see this. This is my prayer for you, Kate. Bless your gentle soul. That's a fire hazard. Kate, I would give up my power if I could have another rewind to save you. I won't rest until we find out the truth. And somebody pays for this. Hey, Max. I, I saw you go up on the roof to try to help Kate. I can't believe she jumped. I can. I just wish I could have stopped her. Are you okay? I'm just, like, numb. I, I've never seen anybody actually die. Me neither. I didn't think you'd be so upset considering how much shit you and Victoria gave Kate. I'm my own person, not Victoria's bitch. Hello, like, she's freaking too. She already broke curfew tonight. <gasps> Shit, I'm not supposed to tell anybody. Where did she go? I know I can trust you since you were so nice asking about my mom in the hospital, but Victoria will, like, make my life hell if I blab, okay? No doubt. I do hope your mother gets better. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks. You're like weird, but pretty cool, Max. Especially after watching you go up on that roof. Victoria's wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk to you later. Okay, let's see if we can find out where Victoria went, I guess.
I know. Victoria must be upset since I saw her sneaking out of the dorm past curfew. Oh man, like, you saw her? She was so, like, nervous when she left the dorm. She wouldn't even tell me where she was going. Probably to hell. Oh. Well, I have to go crash. Probably <laughs> it's been hell, a rough she's day, a as you know. Thanks, Max. And I hope you're okay, too. You were the only one who tried to save Kate. Victoria was wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk to you later. Okay. So I guess, uh... She doesn't know where Victoria is. Uh, Victoria went isn't either. here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time. Going through her shit. Dana's really hurting over this. Oh, I miss your light, Kate. Where's Dana? This is both sad and pathetic. Okay, that's already... We already, uh... Saw that the first time. Aw, Trevor is a sweetie. Good for Dana. Hey Dana, I've been thinking about you all day and know how shitty it was to see Kate jump from the roof today. I don't have anything deep or smart to say, I just want you to know that you are a good friend to her and I wish she had more friends like you. You have been so good for me when everything else is so fucked up and I am here for you always. I miss you, Trev. If Dana That's talks to Juliet about need. this, she's gonna wish she didn't. Dana, I hope you're doing okay after today. I don't want to bother you, but I'm writing an article about Kate for the paper and I wanted to know if you could answer just a few short questions. It seemed like there are too few answers. Let's talk when it's convenient for you, okay? Hope you're well. Sincerely, Juliet. Oh, she replied. Hi, Juliet. I know you want to find out more about Kate, but I'm kind of still in shock and mourning. And I don't think you'll get too many answers so soon after what happened today. And maybe it's better to keep a low profile for the moment. So, Dana. Okay, Dana replied to this one too. I just didn't see it because it's so light gray. Thank you so much for thinking of me. I keep seeing Kate jump and feel like I could have done more to save her. Even Max Caulfield did more than anybody to try to save Kate. I can't wait to see you tomorrow. And you're just as good for me as you think I am for you. Dreaming of you tonight. XXOO Dana. Okay. Oh, my fucking god. I didn't know she was here. Jesus hey, Dana. Christ. How are you doing? I just can't stop thinking about Kate. And if this is my fault, too. Mm hmm. Hmm. All of us, I guess. I think we're all responsible for what happened. Not you, Max. You were close to her. You were nice. You were nice to Kate. That's all she needed from everybody else here. Tell that to Victoria and the Vortex Club. Dana, there's more to this than just Victoria and the Vortex Club being mean. So what exactly are you saying, Max? You think this has something to do with Nathan being expelled? It's complicated. It's complicated. I don't want to drag you into this, okay? Not yet, anyway. I'm getting scared now. But people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like, who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sharla? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. I'll see you later. Okay. <sighs> that sucks. Let's see. Um... Stella, Miss UK. My prayers for you. Hold on, Victoria's right across from us, isn't she? Why don't we snoop? Victoria is about as straight as me. But she really appreciates style. A unique point of view is right. Thanks to Courtney Wagner ghostwriting this paper. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's see. What else? First Rachel and now Kate? This is the end of the Vortex Club. Well, well. Maybe Victoria isn't a monster after all. Hey, sweet tea. What up? I'm just avoiding some lame-ass science homework. How can anybody do fucking homework after seeing somebody jump to their death? I can't believe we all saw it happen live. 
It was like watching a reality show and I've never seen the campus so quiet. Like everybody's hiding or crying. I feel like total shit for everything I said about Kate in that stupid video. Let's get some peeps to meet up later. This girl needs a serious curfew cocktail. We'll drink to Kate. I'm sorry too, Victoria. I can't stop seeing Kate fall. I need a drink stat. Let me know the time. Exo sweet tea. It's like that's a Taylor for and so Victoria so talking. Max Crackby? Oh my god. Lame. Party on, dude. The Tweemo bitch, Max Cockfield, got me fucking suspended. Can you believe it? My dad owns the fucking dorm where she plays with her selfies. My parents have lost their shit and are threatening me with a fucking job in my dad's office. How dumb is he to have me repping him? Max Crackfield and Blackwell need to go fucking down. And the end of the world party is fucking on. You in? Victoria to Nathan. What the fuck are you kidding me? That is bullshit. No way can Blackwell suspend you. I knew that Max was troubled the first time I saw her ass kissing Mr. Jefferson with that retro cam era. Notice that everybody she hangs around gets in trouble. And yes, the Vortex Club will be bringing the end of the world to Blackwell no matter what. I'll SMS you later so we can plot in person. Hang in there. Okay, that's... <sighs> fucked up. Here they are getting loaded with Victoria is being brainwashed by Nathan. Oh my god. I don't think, uh... I don't think Victoria is a bad person. I just think she's a sad person. I'll title this one, Portrait de la Assholes. Whoa, there's Kate. Totally high. She looks confused. Not like she's partying. Can we take it? I'll title this one Portrait de I la guess Assholes. That would be These socks good proof to have, have though. Oh my god, who would pay a million bajillion dollars for socks? Me if I was rich, I guess. <laughs> When you're rich, I guess it doesn't, uh, doesn't matter. Is there nothing else? I already opened that drawer. There's just a sock. I open. Oh, let me look That's at this trash, paint, I guess. Just to clean paint from a sweater. $30? Well, it was cashmere, I guess. Did I already open this? Here I feel like I did. Yeah, I did. I did. Okay. I think <sighs> that's all I can do right now. I guess I shouldn't be so bummed. Not that Victoria couldn't hide her shit. Man, I'm getting paranoid. Okay. Okay, we didn't find really much in Victoria's room besides her emails, I guess. So she's sneaking out to get wasted. Oh, look at the little lightning bugs. They're so cute. Oh, I love it. So Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. Jesus. I still can't believe she jumped. If the wind knocks one of those candles over, there's gonna be a school fire. Not to be that person, but uh, it happens. Kate is dead and I'm Look at the squirrel. Yeah, well, I wonder if I could... No, that door is closed. I was wondering if I could go see if I could, uh... I don't know, that place where we turned the, uh, sprinklers on that one time. Are you if anything serious? There. I'm toasted. He's lucky nobody else saw him nobody like that. Me. Except me. Not yet, anyway. Thinking, do I rewind? He's lucky nobody else saw him like that. Oh my god, run. Except me. Max. Okay, three from Chloe. Max? Oh, not from private number. Hey whore, feminazis will be exterminated. Watch out. Okay, so that's Nathan. Warren. Uh... Hey Max, don't want to bother you, just checking in to see how you are. I know today was hard, but you did more than anybody else could have to help Kate. I'm proud of you. And please, no worries about going to the drive-in, but if you want to escape to a planet of apes, let's go. And if you need to talk, I'm always here. 
Thanks, Warren. I'm still processing. Nathan got suspended, at least. I'll call you later, okay? Oh, okay. Hold on. Okay, I never read this one. Hey, honey, I hope you didn't forget to water the plant we gave you, but don't drown it either. Mommy. Max, please call us as soon as you can. We know this is painful, and we want to know how you are, so please, please get in touch. And if you want to come and spend some time back home, the door is open and your bed is made. We love you. I'll call you right away. Love you. It was so good to hear your voice. Remember what we talked about. You were there for your friend when she had nobody else, and Kate made her own choice. Nobody could expect more than what you did. You're our hero, and we love you so much, Maxine. Call us anytime if you need to talk or visit. The ninja strikes again. Okay. Now we snuck uh, past our principal, because he's drunk. I guess he uh, is stressed about what's happening, as he should be. <laughs> and now we're going to go see Chloe! Let's see what she has to show us, I guess. Booyah! Oh my god. Hi. Get it? Booyah. Like I'm a scary punk ghost. Well, like a scary and sensitive asshole. Ooh. Chloe, I watched my friend jump off a roof today. I don't think you need to prank me tonight. You always trip out on me for not being there for you, but is this how you're there for me? I'm... I'm sorry, Max. I, I wasn't even thinking. I suck. I'm not trying to be a bitch, but... I'll never get the image out of my head of Kate jumping off that roof. All because my power didn't work. It didn't mean shit. Mm. I know seeing Kate fall was horrible. I don't even know how to deal with that, so I just act like an idiot. But it's your badass power that's gonna bring all this to a close. We just need to connect the players. And find out who really killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? Didn't you say that it was all about chaos theory? I don't mm. see any control over this chaos. Oh, right. Except for your ability to... Oh, yeah. Manipulate time and space? No biggie. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? Mm. Right. For one thing, there's too much coincidence between the people around Kate and Rachel. Like Step Prick and Nathan Prescott? Not just them. Yep. I just want to beat the shit out of those particular bros. I can still feel David's hand on my face. Mm -hmm. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... Dead? Yeah. I'm sorry. I hate even saying that, Chloe. Not as much as She's I hate thinking. She's in a red binder. It. And now Kate Next, is we have too. to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Wow! We got ourselves some you keys. You are such a boss, Chloe. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Oh. Uh -huh. grown here. Okay, it's still a cutscene. Where are we gonna go? Thank you again so oh, much shit. for helping me put together a portfolio. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted, as you know. Ooh. It's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day, and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Ooh. Thank you, Victoria. Upset over Kate as well. I'm like still in shock. I've never seen anybody die. I really cared about Katie. Katie? I no, you didn't. I had didn't. no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still I a go, and care, I still have to pick really. the winner to best represent Blackwell. 
I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know what's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together oh in San Francisco, God. Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. Ooh. And, She's uh, trying to seduce him. I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's oh not like God. you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you Ooh. think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might Ooh. as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor oh to your my future, God? I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. Wow, now blackmail. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... Mm -mm. Gross. Hi, baby cat. I'm playing a game right now. I love you so, so much. Just when I think Victoria can't get Ooh. any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. Hi, baby cat. I'm playing a game right now. <laughs> oh, no, this is where the scene went down. Chloe the Keymaster. You know it. Okay. Dude. I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. Still a good scene. always let me get busted like this we did so with the long. weed. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? We get charges for just entering. I'm serious. We could go to jail. Not if I'm really oh into the Oh my god, just security. entering. That's so Stuff funny. Stuff shit will not want me in the hands of the local police. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. Tell that to Kate. Well, I couldn't do that with Kate. Come on, so you never one know, more door actually. and our work here is done. Okay, guys, I'm gonna end it there. Thank you so much for watching this part, and I will see you in the next one. Bye! Bye! Baby, come here! Come here! Baby.